Rob, when the old guard heating engineers such as myself used to balance uh, radiators, we used to touch the radiator to, to assess its temperature and we just only used to wind it down on the lock shield and not the special control on the TRV. Is this a good way to balance heating systems now? It's not the most efficient way of doing it. That way you are ensuring every radiator gets hot. But what you don't know is, is it getting the correct amount of heat? Because it's really key to ensure that you've got the correct return temperature from every radiator based upon the room temperature you're working to. Because it's the water flow that's actually carrying the heat energy, correct. isn't it? Correct, yeah. The, the more water you have flowing through a radiator, the more heat energy that radiator will output. And generally speaking, the higher the return temperature. So by just a touch temperature, you're looking at the average which may not give a correct return temperature or room temperature at the power requirement for that room. And how do we do that now? We, we, we use clip-on thermometers and also take an ambient temperature as well. Yes, we? correct. It's really key to be able to take both the flow temperature, return temperature and the ambient temperature when you're setting these up. And so we, we, we can get technology now where you, where you get the delta T between flow and return and we, that, the ambient temperature is very important as Extremely well. Extremely important, yes. Yeah. So a balancing radiator seems like a, a really long procedure and this is, is this part of the commissioning process that should be happening? Yes, definitely. Um, it has to be a long procedure because you've got to wait for the whole heating system to heat up before you can set a balance. And then you need to be visiting each individual room and coming back and comparing them against each other. Because when I make a change in a bedroom, that will also affect the bathroom as an example. Rob, is there another way we can balance radiators? Yes, yeah, so another way to balance radiators is with automatic flow control TRVs. We've developed one of the first domestic AFC technology TRVs. And the idea with these is they will set the flow rate directly on the valve itself. Mm -hmm. So what that means is if you have five radiators, all of exactly the same size, the same heat output, every setting will be the same. And then we'll self-balance for you. I hope you enjoyed that. Thanks very much. This is your opportunity to rate us. Drop us a like if you think it was good. Leave us a comment, subscribe, uh, share it with someone you think you might like it. And we'll see you soon.